All the single gears here. This is what they call prophecy with instant solution. Zion. I'm from Cross River State, Boki local government to be precise. So my testimony goes like this. Um, I've noticed a pattern um, in my paternal side. The female in my father's side doesn't get married. Only the male do get married. So I've been praying over it. It is either they get pregnant out of wedlock and then they will move to the uh, man's house and start living with the man just like that. That is what has been happening from my father's side to all the females there, including my parents' children. Me, I'm the last daughter of my parents. So I've been praying over this and I said, this thing will not happen to me. One faithful day, I was watching um, Open Heaven. Daddy located me. There's a lady called Stella. Stella. Your marital delay yoke is destroyed. Amen. Get ready for testimony. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. So I keyed into that. I've been praying along with that testimony. So I was still hoping the year is running out already. I was giving up. I said, hey, the year is running out. Too. This thing that is said has not come to pass. God, when? I was believing God and waiting on the Lord. So I came for a single program last year. I keyed into that program. In short, I came with some of my friends. The next day morning, some of them started leaving. They said, let's go, let's go. I said, I will stay till Sunday, till the end of this program. I stayed. The rain that fell that night beat me. I said, this rain is a sign. It means that I received my blessing. Daddy will not mention my name and it will not come to pass. And the day that he said that thing was the eve of my birthday. So it was like a birthday gift to me. So I've been praying towards it. So... All of a sudden, uh, people started coming from different angles. Um, only me, oh, Germany, oh, UK, oh, Canada, oh, they, they're seeking for my hand in marriage. I say, God, even in Nigeria, yeah, somebody from Chevron, you know, they, queued, they lined up for me. I was confused. Then I told God that before I was praying that when the time is ripe, that they should line so that we choose. But now I cannot choose, though. Let me not buy um, big eyes now. Go and choose country that's... I will not end up with the wrong person. I started telling God that God should, God should um, put pressure on the right person. So that was how my husband started talking about it with seriousness, that he wants to come in January. The, the coming was for visits. So he, just turned, he had already booked the visa to come just for visits. All of a sudden, I think they announced something there in UK. It's a nurse. So they said um, all nurses that from April, they will stop them from bringing in their spouses. Ah. So that's an aunt ginger him. Instead of coming for visits that he has already did the visa for, when he, he now told me that I should go to Ikoi registry and go and make an inquiry about court marriage. Ah. I said, just like that. So I called my mom. I said, Mommy, see what is happening. I told her everything. Meanwhile, I was still praying. So I went back to that video that he said, and I want to listen to it again. I mistakenly entered one for 20, 26th of um, uh, March last year. Then he was telling us about prayers. That we should be praying midnight prayer, radically, pray naked, and all of that. So I was doing all of those things. I said, God, please, let not let me fall into a wrong hand. Because this thing is happening too much that I, I cannot even withstand it again. So I talked to my mom. My mom said, okay, we have to see our people. So that was how my husband came down to Nigeria. And we did the introduction in my house. After the introduction, we went for the court marriage. And then after the court marriage, he told me that I, should, I started applying for visa. And my visa has been approved. So he came back in um, April this year. We have done the traditional marriage and the white wedding. You can see the evidence of their marriage on your screen now. To the glory of God, as I'm speaking to you all, I'll be living, my, living with my husband to UK. Um, praise the Lord. Marriage is done and dusted. Visa is sure. May your name is what? My name is Stella Bisong. From where? From Cross River State. Cross River. You say prophecy was given to you. Yes, open heaven. And after that, everywhere block. Nothing was working before. I was having disappointment upon disappointment. So until that prophecy came. Men started disturbing you. It queued up for me, different countries. They queue different countries. Yes, sir. I profess all the singles here, men we kill. Amen. Amen. Look at the couple after the prophecy. No man had, could have come until that prophecy. And she said that that day was her birthday, the 12th. And the prophecy came. All the single girls here, this is what they call prophecy with instant solution. solution.